Oh, much better. Okay, let's get this party started. One, the Bible's amazing composition. Although <clears throat> God is the author of the Bible, the actual writing was done by men. Inspired by the Holy Spirit. More than 40 men were involved in writing the 66 books that make up the Bible. At least. You could probably double that. Triple it, maybe. Who knows? <clears throat> oh, Ooh, I must have forget about this. Mm. All better now. Most of these writers never met. Just proves so much. <laughs> As their lifetimes were dis uh, uh, dispersed, yeah. dispersed over a period of sixteen hundred years, they grew up in 13 different countries on three different continents and wrote in three different languages. Some of the writing, some of the writers were kings, statesmen, or doctors. Men of learning. Others were fishermen. What are we talking shit about fishermen now? I fish. I'm not that much of a scholar. <laughs> Others were fishermen, shepherds, or farmers, and nothing wrong with that, right? Men with little formal, formal schooling. Think about it. Forty different writers separated by time, geography, politics, culture, vocation, social standing, and even language. That proves a whole lot, too, I guess. And I look forward to someone explaining that to me. Okay. What would you expect such a varied group to produce but disorderly, uh, a disorderly mass of confusion and contradictions? Yeah, none of that there. They're going to tell us there's none of that there, I guess. <laughs> Yet, the Bible has one central message. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> <clears throat> one code of ethics and one plan of salvation. Oh, really? <sighs> one person, Jesus Christ, is the main focus of 66 books. The marvelous unity of the Bible can be explained only by its divine authorship. Case closed for at least the first point there. So, what do you think? <laughs> I think I could do a whole mess of videos uh, where I address each one of these points, maybe later. But anyway, I'm just reading it.
to be continued in part PowerPoint 2, prayer, Power Prayer Point 2, something like that. Uh, <coughs> the Bible claim to inspiration. So stay tuned for that. Let me know if you learn anything here. If you're saved already or if you need a little more persuasion, because I'm not done.